Welcome to i -Corps. I'm thrilled to have you here. I'm Marty Van Scott, Director of the Office of Licensing and Commercialization. And I am thrilled to have you here. I have to get my toys out. Um, i -Corps is a great program. We've had a lot of great results. Um, a lot of really good teams have come through it, and they have learned a lot through the experience, not just from what we taught them, but from what they learned from um, going through the process, and I think you will too. Many of you have gone to our information sessions. The, um, several of the teams have gone through the i -Corps program, have um, advanced at different pitch competitions, raised money, um, one, I don't know, what a magus one of $250,000 award, things of that nature. So clearly it must work because people are progressing and advancing. So I'm thrilled that you all decided to take the leap of faith and join us today. Um, I'm mic'd for the first time here, so I'm trying to decide if I'm more like Ellen or O. Ellen? Oprah. 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 Um, I, I, I do not have a car, but, um, but I do have purple and gold beads, which we will use, actually. So what is the start of a program without an icebreaker? Icebreakers are important a little bit and um, gets the ideas free flowing. So that's something you're going to experience here in i -Corps, and that is this free-flowing ide um, ideas of moving around. Um, you may have ideas flowing amongst yourselves within your team, ideas flowing from the mentors who are here um, to your teams, and then amongst each other, because there could be some experiences that you have that could be valuable to them, or perhaps some connections that you have that they don't otherwise have and vice versa. So um, it's all about us um, being open and sharing information and connections and even our Rolodex sometimes with others to help them advance. So I think you're going to enjoy this. So I want you all to notice on your tables you should have at least two gadgety things here. Here we got us. I'm not going to describe what it is because we're well, going to turn it into something different. But you all have a couple things on your table. So you have a challenge here. And the team who responds best to the challenge gets the immunity beads. They get the purple immunity beads because it's important to be wearing some form of purple on Friday. Mine is hidden. It's in my earrings. But they are there. Um, so your challenge today, and which is why I want you to work in groups, some of you are within your own teams, and some of you are multi-teams multi at a table, and that's fine. That's, that works out well. Is I want you to take a look at the two things on your table, and I want you to um, not focus on what they actually are. Don't worry about their actual form and function. But I want you to identify in five minutes a new and useful application of these objects to solve some kind of wicked problem. And I could tell you what wicked problem. You all figure that one out. Wicked is big. You till 10 after by my watch to work as a team at the end of your five minutes, you're going to report out to the rest of the group what your new object, your new project, pro product, whatever is. Oh, I, and the best winning team gets not only the um, immunity beads, but we give extra credit for humor. Okay? Humor is important in this exercise. Yes. Um, do we have to use both of them together to solve a problem? Or you decide. Oh. You all decide. And we have multiple.